Weber better than Wendy? Depends on what you mean by better. But um, if you're talking about like just general boss rushing, I think Wendy's much better. Weber requires too much like jumping through hoops to get his spider army here and there. And yeah, it's just more of a hassle. It takes longer to set up. All right, let's find a good server for me to join. Day one. Caves. Do this. Damn it, we got Woody and Wigfrid. That means somebody's gonna be rushing the ruins. And I got red. What is the server? It's like a European server or something. Whatever, make do. Hey, Red Tooth, how's it going, man? This is US East. Okay, it shouldn't be that bad. Yeah, definitely playable. Doing pretty good. Just trying to do some Weber things in a pub. Because it's always fun to play with other people. And the cool thing about Weber is that the way he plays, I mean, you can obviously play him like Wilson, but if you're going to use fighters, then bad ping isn't really that much of a deal. Because you're not really kiting, coming your army to attack stuff. Are you doing the thing with the toad caps? No, I need some uh, friends for that. Because, dude, the setup for that is so enormous. Like, first you gotta kill Toadstool and hope that you get the red fun cap recipe. So there's a 1 in 3 chance that even if you do everything right, you're gonna fail. This is why you wanna do Toadstool first. Hey, Tempered. How's it going, man? So yeah, you gotta beat Toadstool. You do a dice roll for a 1 in 3 chance to get the uh, red fun cap recipe. Then you gotta get like... Six red caps for every fun cap you want to make. After that, you gotta go to Lunar Island. You gotta get the altar pieces, and then um, you can build your. Actually, before you go to Lunar Island, you gotta go to the uh, Lunar Grotto and get four moon shrooms for every fun cap you want to eventually make. Go to Lunar Island, assemble the altar pieces. And then you can make all your uh, hats. And you gotta go back to the mainland, get your spider army. And then you can kind of do the tricks. But even then, it's not gonna work because, as you saw in the video, you need to put people to sleep for it to actually kill people because they'll just outrun it. So, yeah. I mean, you can do it by yourself, but there's just so much things that can go wrong. So much oops, you gotta jump through. It's better to just do it with friends. Just got finished watching the carpet bombing. Hilarious. <laughs> Sangha. Mikey. What's up, man? Yeah, so... When you get bored of this game and you're tired of just fighting bosses all the time, then you 
fall back on pranks. It's ironically what I kind of started my channel with. Like the first prank I did was that uh, free gifts thing where I played Wendy, rushed Bee Queen, then I bundled a bunch of spiders, and then I just put them by a sign that said free gifts and hopefully people would unwrap it. Yeah, so kind of trying to go back to my roots, if you think about it. I hear pigs. This is pretty good. No, it's not good, actually. I was hoping this was the... Uh, Moonstone Forest, but this is actually triple mech. I have six gold. How much gold do I need? I need four for an alchemy. I need four for the tools. Like the golden pickaxe and the axe. And then I need two for the two uh, fire hats I'm gonna make. So a total of ten gold. Like we should have secretly killed most bosses with three mooses. If we do that, Mikey, we gotta just leave all the loot on the ground. So people are like, what is going on? So like, V-Queen, we can't even pick up the Royal Jelly next time. Just gotta leave it. Dragonfly, just leave everything. Also leave everything. But then again, like, if you're playing on a pub, how much of those bosses are people gonna kind of encounter. I don't think people would see Toadstool. People are gonna just like not even explore the caves all that much. But yeah, the Dragonfly and Bee Queen. That'd be kind of funny to get people to comment about that. And Woody in general, you can just do a lot of funny, like, interactions with other people. Like, Mass was suggesting we all go beaver and just destroy every forest in the server. So whenever somebody sets foot in there, they're going to be like, why, why is there literally no tree in this forest? Everything is chopped down, but nobody picked up the loot. Like, just things like that. Or we could all go goose and just harass one person, you know? That's another option. Yeah, I'm in a pub, but I'm trying not to say that too much because I'd rather get you know, non-viewers to play with so you can see like real interactions. But yeah, we got a Wigfred and a Woody. Looks like they're working together. I think Cirrus, I recognize the name, so actually. One way to check if these players are legit is just to check their skill tree. One, two, three, four, five. What's Goose Mastery? <laughs> Interesting, man. Perplexing. But no, none of the affinities? Okay, so this guy isn't like super hardcore. Because he has, doesn't have the affinities. Um, how about Wigfred? Take Wigfred out. Wigfred. Interesting. No uh, Elving Spear. Okay. The two people are not using the meta. Woody is probably just based on the skill tree. Not as skilled as Wigfred. But uh, who knows? And he has Goose Mastery, man. An odd one. Only thing pubs will touch is probably AG and Ruins, and that's it. Yeah. They'll touch that, but um, they will discover Bee Queen and Dragonfly. Like, they will encounter those set pieces. I think those are the three. Maybe not more of Werepig 2, because it's on the way to the Ruins, usually. Yeah, other than that, like, Toadstool. That's Twins of Terror, you know? You did that, too. 
starting to feel that Ruins Rushing is overrated now. <laughs> yeah. Some people get really mad at you if you Ruins Rush. I think I already told this story. But I was in like a, a pub a couple days ago. Or maybe a week ago. I got super mad because you saw me rushing the ruins. OMG, what's going on? Dragonfly is next to Pit King. Okay, we know what we're doing here. <laughs> we know what we're gonna do, guys. Once we have enough people, we're gonna we're gonna put Dragonfly into our base. If we base a Pit King, I'm not confident in kiting pigs because. This is a pub. I don't have the best ping. My first time in ruins with Weber. Three rooks flattened the 20 dangers. A few nurse fighters. Yeah, you gotta fight the rooks independently. Like one by one. Only way to do it. This is actually a pretty darn good place to be Weber. Like, look at that. Look at all these spider men. It's a free pig house too. So that's pigskin. If I'm playing uh, Weber in a pub, I usually don't even count on using pigskin because everything gets busted. Backpack. Uh, I don't have enough grass though. I need some grass. Pretty good location though. All these spider dens. Um, what I need to do is find a touchstone. That's my number one priority because I need to get nurses before I go to the ruins. I got a touchstone. Got to get ten silk. I have two right now. Probably gonna mow down some of these spider dens. The ones that are kind of spread out. Oh, got a chester. Yes. I could always go for a let me amulet or a red gem, you know. But uh, very unreliable. And then Weber has his low sanity threshold. Oh god! Oh no! He killed it. Still got my torch. Oh, there's um the grass I need. No. Oh come on, this game. There's a pickaxe. What would you say your favorite raid boss to fight is? Um, I think that depends on what character I'm playing as. But. Overall, it's gotta be Fuel Weaver. Because uh, he's like the highest skill boss. And um, you have teleports or AoE, it changes up the fight. So yeah. I'd say Fuel Weaver, and then second would probably be. Maybe Dragonfly is pretty fun because you get to run around. I like, I like bosses that encourage movement. If you don't use walls, you can run around the arena, go to lobby and stuff. Least favorite raid boss is probably B Queen. It's kind of weird that even though I'm a Wendy main, but yeah, now that Crypto has been redesigned, I think B Queen is probably the worst boss. What is the best solo DSD character to main? That really depends on your playstyle, but if we're talking about like strongest character, I mean, there's it's a sandbox game, right? So the goal is really whatever you want the goal to be outside of don't die. We always have to define what our goal is. Um, 
we have these like conversations about best character. But yeah, if your goal is, you know, the typical stuff that I do, which is fight bosses. Um the best character to do the quickest is gonna be Wolfgang, because he gets all his perks very early. Um other than that, it's all about preference, which character you have one with. kind of organize them in if, if you want to just go by effectiveness you can organize characters into tiers but best is different than effectiveness right this is like a combination of um, like how much fun you have with the characters and like possibly is this character easy to master how easy does this character make the fights I kind of like to enjoy the game more than to fight bosses. Okay, yeah, it's, that, that's that's a great reason why we should define our terms before we have this conversation. But if you're just trying to enjoy the game overall, I don't know. I'd say Wendy is like a jack of all trades. Really good at fighting. Really good at support. Don't have to worry about Hound Wave late game. AoE is always really good in this game. I don't know. Dejan has joined the spider gang. Alright, let's see if I can kite this pig. Actually, I don't have to. I'm uh, talking about the Dragonfly Desert. I guess they're trying to clear it out. That's my guess. Hmm. I just run away from these dudes. Okay, who's... I guess this is your house. Get up. WX is the best fun solo. I don't know, I haven't played too much WX. Um, the only problem I have just from like an outsider perspective is that I don't think he changes up much of the boss fights, right? He's, he's Wilson with super speed, which is what it usually boils down to. His uh, overheat or his freezing circuits, like that can basically be replaced by thermal stone. Doesn't really have any AOE. He does have like that reflecting damage kind of thing with his uh, shocking circuits. But I'm not sure, like typically you don't want to be taking damage, right? You want to be dodging attacks instead of tanking them and if you are tanking them against something like B-Queen I think the electric circuits there's a limit on how much they can reflect uh, given a specific time I'm not sure how good they are against the grumbles uh, and then you got you know you have your super speed circuits which are always great against everything so I don't know I'd have to look into it because I haven't really done a lot of WXing but from what I've seen He's Wilson with super speed, but it usually ends up with, or that's like the meta. Night Vision is cool, but um, Night Vision, there are, like, there are solutions that make Night Vision kind of pointless, right? Like you got Moggles, uh, Star Color Staff, Magi. Oh wow, that was a huge lag. Alright, let's 
see, is this enough to start a spider war? Probably not. We need a lot more than that. These dents gotta be at least tier two. Start digging up graves, hopefully. That's pretty good. But I was hoping for a life giving. Make things way easier. I personally think that Weber is maybe the funnest character in the game because you can play him like Wilson if you want to. But the way he fights really changes up, like typical combat. And um, it's not like Merms where they're so strong that all you do is just left click on the boss and the boss dies. Like you have to do strategy, you have to know how the boss works. If you don't then all your effort into putting together the army is just going to go to waste. And uh, if you play them right, then unlike Merms, these spiders never become disloyal. So they'll always be with you. And you basically have a permanent like army that will just kill everything. If you do it right. Oh great. I don't want to deal with nightmares. Uh. You know what? Actually, maybe I should, right? Because if I kill enough nightmares, I get the nightmare fuel. Then I can just make the uh, life giving amulet after I get the Presti. It's so tedious, though. So much easier if I just get a uh, touchstone. more monster meat. burn this tree, will it spread to everywhere? I don't think so. That is a red. I want the red. That's a uh, green. Green. Nice shuffle. I cannot find a solution for when Web Weber loses connection or dies and all the spiders turn hostile to teammates. <laughs> Like word, yeah, that is, sh yeah, I, there is no solution if your teammates are close. Um, if you lose connection when your teammates are not close, like they're off screen, or they're, um, they're not loaded into your screen, I guess you'd say, and your spiders are all near you, then they don't turn hostile. They'll just wait for you, uh, to rejoin. Yeah, there's nothing you can really do. I guess you can call that part of the randomness of this game. Hey, wait for it. I guess that's Pig King. They're already setting up there. Leave me alone. Uh, that's probably Pig King, and right next to it is Dragonfly Desert. No touchstones, though. That sucks. I really want to find touchstones. Uh. Come on, man. I guess I'll take this. Get a star collar eventually. Maybe I should give them Chester because I'm not going to be on the surface all that long. Uh, come on, kill, kill it. Oops, terrarium unopened. Did you just some gold in here? Yep, that. Healing cells. Drop. 
Oh, I get some pigskin too. That's a spider set piece. I will take that. Because I don't think these guys should be hostile to me. I don't know, set pieces are kind of wonky in this game sometimes. Let's see. Yeah. Cool. You guys thinking more of a casual play style. He's definitely not that unique, but I'm sure he can be fun. Yeah, I guess you're right. I was still thinking of it through a boss rushing lens. Yeah. Depending on your playstyle, any character can be fun, I guess. Um, with my unique perspective, you know, the way I see the game. WX is like Wilson with super speed. You know, the, the coolest thing about WX is that you don't need a B flow, right? Once you assemble all the pieces, you're moving faster than the B flow, so it's like the one character other than maybe like Wanda late game or uh, what's what's this? What's her face? Winona late game. That um, it doesn't make sense to tame a B flow. Your movement speed is just better. Yeah, that's like a big plus for WX. That pig was out for blood. Is that real? Magic Forest never has a touchstone? I never knew that. But is this even Magic Forest? It, 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 uh, ye, no. I don't think this is Magic Forest. This is like a, an extra forest. Like the... Right? Because this is the entire thing. There's no Mandrakes. There's no Beefalo. It's like an extra forest like you know like the triple mac or whatever it's like a bomb that's not supposed to always generate pig village forest the mini swamp uh what is this guy though that's probably magic or is that moonstone no, it's probably Moonstone, huh? Uh. Wow, it's just me and... Me and Wakeford now. Actually, I don't even mind if, if everybody leaves. I'm still gonna do my own thing. Uh. Oh my gosh, I forgot to make the... The razor. An idiot. At this point, it wouldn't be too hard to just make a Presti. The hard part is getting insane. How do I go insane as Weber? I guess dig up all those graves over there. Shrooms. Oh yeah, green shrooms. But you know what? I'm gonna go dig up those graves because maybe I don't even have to make a press stick. I just make a dig up a light bit. I should make a hand bat though. Make myself an actual weapon. This meat. And day four. So we got so much to do before I go to the caves. Got seven silk. Ah, oh, man. Hey, pitch book. More red gems. I don't want red gems. I don't want blues. I want that. Yep. More red gems. Come on. Just give me a life giving. All the red gems in the world. Ghost. They're probably made a football helmet too. Got eight pigskin. Plenty. Uh, nope. Don't want that. Don't want any of that. 
And I'm probably gonna get hounded by terror beaks. They're all gonna come at one time. It's not gonna be like one, one versus one. There you go, first one. Where's the second one? It's gonna pop up like any second. That was freaking lag. Come on. Alright, just one. Another ghost. So no luck with the life giving us. Have any advice for beating you, CK? With Wigfrid, if I recall your S tier video for her was before the rework. Yes, it was. Advice. Um, well, Wigfrid plays the CK fight the same as uh, everyone else. So it's just a basic, basically Wilson with extra damage, I believe. Elding Spear doesn't really come in handy because you can't really dash on a boat. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if you guys can think of anything, but to me, Wig, Wigford seems like it's just Wilson against Crab King. I could be wrong. One more. Uh, come on, catch it, catch it. Awesome. I think I might have just enough. Weaponize Warble with Dark Sword since the fight is tedious. Yeah, just max out your your damage. Don't hold back with a hand bat. Just go full on Dark Sword. And I would even say that if you're Wakefred, just because of how dangerous Crab King is, I would go uh, Shadow Line for Wakefred instead of Lunar Line. Because I don't know about you guys, but I think that uh, Crab King would be more dangerous than uh, what's that, Fuel Weaver. I think Fuel Weaver is harder. But there's just so much shenanigans that can happen in the crab, crab King fight. Like a random bird can fly in the place that you want to place a like, grass raft, which just blocks you. Or like you might slip at the wrong time. I don't know. And there's like one bad thing and it's good game. So I'll venture to say just maximize your damage. Just go shadow line. It's that extra 10%. Uh, soliloquy? Okay, the thing about soliloquy is that you're gonna have to constantly be using it. Wait, is it so I don't think it's 6 seconds anymore, it's like... They doubled it, recently. So, it is good, it would panic the mobs. But, um, I would go pan food, man. That would just shut them down completely. Unless you're planning on going all purple gems. You know, and just completely ignoring them and just continue to use Soliloquy. Which is a strat. I mean, now that I think about it, that might actually be good. But uh, yeah, to me, I'll just go Pan Flute. Don't even bother. Soliloquy seems like you're just trying to save resources. Shut everything down with the Pan Flute. And just uh, attack. Because with Soliloquy, you're going to have to like stop attacking Crag King for... At least a second, which lets him get a heal in. What am I doing? I gotta catch some rabbits now. Yeah, you should definitely ta practice Crab King. Not go into that fight blind. That's something I, I think most people don't know about this game, which is, like, for the bosses, you don't want to fight them the first time in an actual game. Maybe Deer Clops, like, all the seasonal bosses can do it, or Dragonfly after watching, like, a video on setting up their walls and stuff, but when it comes to the harder ones, like Fuel Weaver, or even Bee Queen and Crab King, like, 
you want to test that out. You want to get familiar with the fight first and then do it in an actual game. Do I have a, an axe? I don't have an axe. I don't know. Oh, I do. I guess you can wait for a rain like spring to make it wet and use the Elding Spear. Yeah, you could, but the problem with the, the rain is that it also makes you wet. And you're not warly. Um, you can perfectly time it, I guess, so that it's right after the rain, so crafting is wet, but... I don't know. Or you could you could use the raincoat. But if you're trying to... Uh, yeah, I guess if, if time is not really an issue for you, then yeah. And you're not really familiar with the, the fight. Just do that. Alright. Got that. Now I just gotta get my rabbits. I get the rabbits and I gotta get another pair of each. Do that right now. Terror beaks and the bats at the same time. Don't suck. That will stay out of their actual range. Maybe they won't notice me. It's all gonna happen at one time, but yeah. It's usually how it is. Yep, here it is. It's gonna call all the other ones. Anyway, I think I only need three nightmare fuel for a life giving. I'm still insane, so I'll take whatever I can get. Uh, come on. Hey, it's Wick for it. What? Come on. What? Are, are rabbits smart now? know to avoid the traps or oh, wait I think it's the edge it's because it's too close to the edge of the world right you like to avoid the edge yeah that's gotta be it or is this guy just really smart no he's dumb okay You know, I would love to make this wig for it, a life giving, so you can make the the uh, heart running ballad song. But I don't have enough nightmare fuel for that. I need the life giving for myself. Not that. Hey. Wait, that's somebody from the chat, right? I have suspicion. I guess I'll make a spawn base. There's a life giving amulet. Alright, ready to go. What can I give this guy? This guy a bunch of twigs. And I'll give you like two flints. That should be enough to get you started.
Uh, I would like to make all my golden tools here because I don't want to come back. Oh yeah, I also need the healing cells here. Sorry, Winona. Not gonna give you anything. Actually, maybe I could give Winona my my flint, right? Wait, I have so much twigs. What the hell? Why did I think I didn't have enough? Oh, Winona's too fast. Forget it. Alright. Last thing I gotta make over here is a boomerang. Uh, actually, I could just drop... Yeah, I should just drop the pickaxe at spawn, because somebody, I'm sure, will use it. Last thing I gotta do is make a boomerang, and I'm ready to go. Go myself, get the spider uh, queen, better nurse. Finally ready. Look how much prep it takes for Weber to go to the ruins, though, man. It was like anybody else, day two, you're down there already. This guy takes so long. But it's just fun when you actually do finally, like, finish all the prep. Is that a burnt tree? Yes, it is. Alright. Got 12 monster meat. Pretty good. Winona in a pub? Is that more common now? Yeah, Winona's good, that's why. Uh, let's see. Okay, thanks. I'm definitely gonna have to experiment a lot. I wanna see if there is a cheap and consistent way to run it. I think you're talking about Crab King. Winona is more common in general, I think. I find her pretty fun. Post rework and skill tree. Yep, that is true. Um, although I do have some big issues with her design, but I'm not a game designer, it's just like me thinking from my enjoyment of the character. Yeah, by the way guys, if you want to be a good teammate, I, that's what I don't see a lot of people doing. I wish more people would do. It's like, if you've been playing on the server for a long time, like, give the new players that join, like, the basic necessities. So, like, four twigs, two grass, and two flint is perfect because, you know, that lets, that lets them craft a torch, which will let them survive the night. And the two twigs and two flint will let them craft a pickaxe, which means they can get more minerals from any boulders they pass by. That's basically all you need to get started in this game. The alternative is like they'll search a barren world for flint, you know, for like two days before like giving up and just leaving. Alright, these are all tier two now. So I think it's enough to start a spider war. What are my thoughts on Winona? I think, um... I do like playing as her. I think she's like... She suffers from the same problem as work a little bit. That every boss fight is kind of like insane now. The best strategy is just to tank and spam the remote. I could be wrong though. I haven't done a full on boss rush with Winona. Because a lot of times, you know, there's theory and then there's actual experience. So, me from like an outside perspective, just looking at the character from what other people have done, it seems like the best strategy is just to get marble suit and just tank. And just spam the remote. I could be wrong. Um, 
I don't like, like, I wish instead of making the catapult super strong and stuff, they would have just added something else instead of it. I keep the catapults as they were, maybe add the, uh, the ability to relocate them. But give her another, like, bread and butter, uh, item that's for combat. Anyway, 7 silk. Upgrade this to tier 3. And then. Making sure all my meat items are in my inventory. I get myself killed. Oh yeah, and if you're doing this on a pub, you should probably get yourself killed next to the spider den so nobody takes your stuff. Let's get the amulet is right there. This is my backpack just so it doesn't spoil. Alrighty. I think I'm ready. If I didn't miss anything. Please don't spawn on me. Can it spawn on ghosts? It can't, yeah? That's good. I never thought about that. Can the I have to spawn on ghosts? Tactical death. Yep. That's another way you can tell if like how good a player is or how experienced they are. If they, they see you getting killed by a spider, if their response is, oh, um, you know, if they think that it's a uh, unintentional death, then they probably don't know too much. Or they're probably less experienced. If they know that it's a tactical death, then it's like, okay, this guy knows what he's talking about. That said, maybe we should expect some of these guys. Let's see, a skill tree. Oh wait, no, I don't want to... Looks like you're fully decked out. Winona might know what she's doing. <laughs> Response, ouch. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm kind of misleading them. Yeah, everybody probably knows already, but... To hunt this guy, there's a 10% chance that a tier 3 spider den turns into a spider queen. Entire reason I'm doing this. What? Okay. <laughs> That's actually pretty good, although it's gonna draw on other pigs. I don't think the pigs can kill the spider queen, it's the only thing I'm worried about. Maxwell legit. Does he know what I'm doing? I want to fight this guy by myself right now because there's a there's a possibility that the spider if I use spiders to fight this the queen they'll kill her. So it's better if you're the only one doing it. Control the fight. Damn it. 
Okay, I take eight hits right now. Ah, uh, come on. Give me the give me the nurse. Holy crap, super laggy. There we go. Thank you. And once you turn it neutral, the queen just leaves. All good. I wish I could lure this spider into the middle of this pig village. But, whatever. Actually, now I can kill it. I can, like, befriend all these other spiders. For uh, the special doodles, this actually puts Maxwell in danger. Don't want that too much. Yeah, good job, man. Good job, Maxwell. You knew what was happening. You know what was up. Huh? There we go. Take care of these guys. And now let's kill the queen. I have a lot of monsters there. I don't really need to do this. There we go. Second nurse. Alrighty. Uh, let's leave. Alright, last thing I gotta do before I go to the caves is just get some honey so I can make more switch doodles and know exactly where that is. It also impressed me how good Wakeford's passive regen is. I fought Dragonfly a few days ago, and I ran out of hunger, and after she got to about 12,000 health, and even without heart running, I could just ignore the health. Really, you can do that even against Dragonfly, because I think the, the calculations for um, her regen is like, the more beefy an opponent is, the less regen you get out of it. So I'm actually kind of surprised that you could, actually, you could uh, tank the uh, starvation damage with just the default regen. That's pretty interesting. Right. I got. Oh, yeah, good. So you fake an attack, all the bees get aggroed onto your spiders, and then you kill the bees one by one. Actually, for ruins, I think two switcher dudes is enough. I can make more when I get to the surface. Alright, let's, uh, let's go to the cave. Um, is this post-CK or pre-CK? Also, I'm pretty... I'm guessing the, the HP regen also applies to freezing overheat. Yep. That's oh man. Don't kill me, please. Don't spawn on me. I wanna leave. Let me be. 
Oh gosh, get away. <laughs> get away from me. I don't want to deal with that nonsense. I'll just do the other worm, the other sinkhole. Did you notice that the dens grow faster now? Yeah. Um, Matt's explained this to me. It's because they changed it so that they continuous they continue to grow even while off screen. So apparently that's the reason why. Although I still find that kind of crazy that they can grow to tier three from tier one in like six days. So yeah, I don't know what's going on there, but apparently that's the thing now. I like it as Weber. Um, but it does feel a little bit off. Cause I'm just used to not seeing tier three dens all over the world by like day ten. But yeah, I guess I should be grateful. All right. I should also be grateful that I just entered this cave entrance like at the start of the day, so I don't get mobbed by all these bunny men. This is not the right way. There's definitely nothing over there. It's gotta be this way. grass for anything. More football helmets. Yeah, but look at that, WX. He joined two days ago, and he's already ready for the ruins. Oh, he has his uh, circuits, right? His, his night vision circuit. I should probably just follow him, because he can see way more than I can. I should probably... Make the switcher doodles before I forget. But yeah, I, I don't know. I think four nurses is like more than enough for ruins. As long as like you're smart about the the rooks, like you try your best to isolate them, to make sure they don't um, attack you in pairs. You also want to stock up on light bulbs because you're using double the light. Oh, wait for it too. Oh, this is a. It's gonna be pretty cool, man. You got like a whole ruins rushing team down here. All right. Yeah, 
And what I want to do is get like a fully 40 stack. Are you watching my stream, Opposer? You better not be saying you're watching my stream. No, Opposer isn't watching my stream. Alright. So we found it. But it looks like it's nightmare phase. I'm in a pub. I do not have good ping. I am very wary of. Uh... Wait, it's not nightmare. Everything's blue. Some sandy from this dude. Oh crap, these monkeys might be a problem. I'm not sure, does WX lose sandy? He has the uh, circuits, like the optical circuits. I wonder. I assume he does, because it's still night time. Okay, back up. Back up, guys. I'm gonna do his thing. Oh no. Alrighty, may I ask what's the name of the body skin you use for wake? Body skin? I'm not sure. I, I, I think Swashbuckler or something? I forget. I gotta check it out. No, no. You know what? I think my spiders can take this guy. Just one monkey. Hiding patterns of these guys are so annoying. Two meats? One monkey? How does that work? Two meats, one monkey. Who would have thought? Um, what can I drop? Hammer, I guess. Combine that and eat one. I don't want the, all the rooks. Kill my monkeys. Uh, I guess I'll drop the flints. I don't need flints, right? All right, let's go. Oh man, I hope I don't die.
know what? I don't need that either. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. I'm so scared. Uh, I gotta drop something. So I'll drop you. Keep my lights. Actually, you know what? I'm pretty sure my spiders can take the bishops because... Yeah. Even though, like, they're all nurses, they should still be able to take the bishops. So, what am I doing? No fear. Like, they just have too much healing. Gosh, four bishops. What the hell? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that was an accident. Misclick. Is that AG right there? It probably is right, because that's not AG, and that's like a second... That's gotta be him. What am I doing over here? Wasting time. Let's go. Oh no. Jugo was a ruse rusher. He wanted AG for himself. Leaves immediately after hearing that he found AG. What a guy. Anyway. Time for Weber to do his thing. What we all came here for. By the way, I didn't talk about this in my, my Weber video. But... Best practice is to pick up your spiders after you blow the whistle. 
because that will delink them from their den permanently. If you do not do that, then what will happen is if you disconnect at the daytime, they will all go back to their dens. Which is why some people like say, why did my spider army just disappear on me? Probably because of that. Anyway, my goal is to get to AG before these guys do. I know we're all teammates, but I really want to see my spider army like slaughter everything. Like they can have all the loot. I don't care about the loot. All I need is like a mag and a star collar. I'm happy. But I really want to fight AG. Robot, what? Oh my gosh. This is what I was afraid of. Alright, come on army, show them what you got. I guess Duke will just like DC. I was an idiot for jumping to conclusion. Actually, a poser probably does need Zambi. So, I just kill my murder creatures. Yeah, you'll be fine. Oh no. Okay, you, you, and you. I think it's you. Not sure. Robot using his cheat mods. That's why he picked uh, War Talks. He knows exactly where we are, so once he gets enough souls, he's just gonna hop right in. Do you mind if I join? Yeah, Mikey, join. Yeah, of course. Oh! Your light went out. Let me get that for you. Fighting AG. Luckily, he's just a WX with a spear, so the fight will take a long time. Hopefully, I'll have a chance to. And there it is, there's a fight. You see the arena. Set up a little bit more because I want to be like fully amped up for a fight AG. Dang it, come on. I think it was you. Not sure which one. I'm being. I'm playing pretty badly. Whatever. 
Let's do this. Let's help out our friend. That's a lot of them, so. That's, uh, lured it away a little bit. Don't you dare get the kill. The meat opposer. The meat. Okay. Uh, I just want. I don't really need anything from here. Just want two of these gems. anything. I think I'm good. Alright, now we gotta go and kill Nightmare Werepig. Actually, my, my army isn't big enough yet. I need more. What's up, man? Uh, I wish you could. Can I make you? Yeah, let me make you a hat. Where's my boomerang? There we go. Remember with army and PvP? I don't know. Seems like it would be really good.
Oh my gosh, did your helmet just break the lot? Come on, man. That was like my last football helmet too. Can't make any more. Oh my gosh, my army. It's so bad. Just leave me alone. Oh, I gave him the 34% one. Okay, <laughs> I thought I gave him the 100. That makes more sense. All right, his last my last monster for me. Make it count. Yeah, I think that's all three of them. All right, let's get out of here. I have one yellow gem for a mag. I don't think I need star color staffs because I got these two uh, miners hats, which I'm not utilizing right now. Get over here. And that's more than enough spiders. That's like that's gotta be over 50 spiders. That's probably 60 plus. So nothing in the ruins should be an issue anymore. Um, I'm, yep. That's what I feared. Everything is cleared. Oh gosh. You guys cleared everything. What the hell? I want at least some to a site. Like maybe a crown. Uh. Gonna give this guy some light. Oh no! Give this guy light. Oh my gosh! No. You know what I can do as Weber? I can actually uh. actually use these walls as a uh, whatchamacall. Oh man. That's a lot of nightmare creatures. I can use these walls as like uh, healing because if I do this, if I get my nurses, they jump. Yeah. That'll heal me up a bunch. Can I help this dude out? I, I wish I could give him my, my bat bat. No, he's fine. He's weak for it. He can heal from everything. That's Weber's one weakness, though, in the ruins. Nightmare creatures, because... Dude, your spiders make it so hard to kite. Man, I hope Bullbot isn't fighting Nightmare Werepig. I was planning on doing that as Weber. They probably are though, those guys. Am I getting trolled on my own stream? Is this uh... This is what I get for doing that stream yesterday. Um, 
I gotta stay put. This guy. Okay, that's another runes branch. The station is probably there somewhere. Should I just run? No, I can't just run because... Oh, look at all that. Where the hell did he pull that out from? What, this, the uh, bone helm? Oh my gosh. They're fighting it without me. Good job, guys. Nightmare phase is so annoying. I can lure. Yep, there it is. Lure him here. Oh, wow, one shot, huh? chance. Dude, this nightmare phase. Just end. What the hell? Finally. He's not cooking the were pig just yet. Okay. I just need a mag, man. Once I get a mag, I have all the speed I need. Because, dude, to navigate with these spiders, you need speed. Yeah, once I get that. And I see the other ruins branch right there. So, should be good to go really soon. I don't think he wrote that, did he? It's more like a part of the mod. We got eight people. That's pretty good. I just need to find one pseudoscience station. I feel like I'm getting trolled. Oh, they don't have the pickaxe. I should probably cook all those green caps too. While I'm here.
I think Morbat uh, lied when he said he had a pickaxe. Is that just like a fake out? <laughs> and I have another football helmet. It was. <laughs> awesome. Alright, I don't think I found Nightmare Were Pig, or did I? Oh, WX is. I can feel his impatience. And, uh. It's not unwarranted. Because he probably thought that Bobot was ready to fight Nightmare Were Pig. <laughs> Doesn't have it. <laughs> I mean, I'm happy. I get to fight Nightmare Wolf Big, you know? Oh, come on. I see Hutch. Why is Hutch just there in the middle of nowhere? Weird. Uh, Trying to help this WX out. That sign lasted a long time. Oh, dude, WX, you're gonna get destroyed if you try to help out. You guys gotta uh, lead him into the pillars, that's why I'm stopping. 
You guys want him to smash the pillars, right? Out, he's gonna he randomly changes his target. How's he still alive? There we go. The fungus. I know that guy. Oh no, what is Bobot doing? <laughs> Kill him. Punch my spiders. How dare you? Man, if we had a Woody, we could kill Toadstool. I don't think we can do it with this crew without my spiders getting destroyed. Weber versus Merms. I think Weber would win as long as he has enough uh, nurses. Actually, if the Merms focus one spider, I think they could kill it before the nurses heal. So maybe not. But if they start like spreading out, oh, I recognize this thing. I want to just bully everything as Weber. Also, you can do this too, guys. <laughs> can instantly destroy the tentacles. Dude, how are you gonna be Woody? Oh, you're gonna do an alt? You're gonna join as your alt? Rabbits, I no longer fear you, rabbits. You're just food for me. I don't care if it's dusk or night. I can Cross your village at any time. Okay, but I kind of go through that wormhole or that the uh, cave entrance because uh, it's right next to spawn. Unless I put all my spiders into the bags, that seems like a really big hassle. Alright, spiders versus bunnies. Idol. Oh my gosh. You have an alt account and you called it Bullbot Roy too. <laughs> Check the pro 
Hippo. Okay, if that's not an alt, then how? I gotta learn that, man. How to just rejoin as a different character. Anyway, I gotta find a different entrance because. Yeah, that's right next to spawn. There's gonna be people. I gotta find like a. That's the one thing I did fail at. Is. Yeah, the one thing I did feel that is locating a cave entrance that is far away and secluded. Because without that, like, there's a chance people will see what you're doing when you're trying to bring your spiders to the surface. And then they'll just mess it up. Uh, I don't have any monster meat, man. <laughs> I don't. And I don't want to kill any of the, my spiders for it. Um. Uh, how would we get monster meats? I guess depth worms? Are you trying to kill yourself? Maybe depth worms or bunny men. No, but what I really want to do is just get out of this cave, man. Oh, uh, there's an ad. Okay, I said I failed at locating a cave entrance. Um, that is far away from like the main paths people travel on the surface because if people come across your spiders when you're not in the shard then the spiders are like they de-link from you so when you want to bring all these guys to the surface you gotta find the cave entrance that's secluded and do your thing there it takes about like half a day of going back and forth between shards which kind of sucks that's just how it is Somebody died. Kenny. That is a new guy. Let's see his skill tree. Interesting. No masteries, huh? Interesting build. Red must tree, there's a good chance that there's a cave exit over here. When you take the stairs, if you don't redeploy a spider, it'll poof. Redeploy? Uh, what do you mean? If you don't drop it? Oh, look at that. Get some strong ones. Thank you. I have one spitter on my team. And uh, I guess I'll pick you up too. I'm going to... Oh! What did I just do? Did I just kill a spider? I think I did. Bobot. Um... Wait for you at Toad. Okay, we're fighting Toad. I am not going to be much of assistance. And I think this is going to go horribly. <laughs> because uh, Moose's charge is horrible for spiders. I hope they don't just kill you. I was thinking, when I said Woody, I wasn't thinking Moose. I was thinking Woody as in the Lumberjack Woody. You can chop the trees down for me. But uh, yeah, let's do it. Let's try it out. This is probably going to go really badly for me. I mean, I know Bobot can solo Toad with two idols. 
but yeah like I gotta be really careful about two things um the stumps and the uh the screeching that Toto does when he uh, changes levels like if he goes from level one to two um where is I'm on the way right yeah I'm almost there and when he spawns spore caps, he panics all the spiders, so like... I gotta just be really on top of it. Um, and keep my spider- like, blow the webby whistle before he spawns them, basically. I think they should be enough to tank, like, the damage that he's gonna do. Although, I'm- yeah, I got, I'm gonna use the webby whistle so much that... Should probably craft another one, just in case. Oh, we got three. Four. Alrighty. I've got Mikey. Yeah, did see this? I cannot be anywhere near. Yeah, I can't even help out. There's so much spore caps all around. I mean, there's spore bombs and spore caps. I can't help out. And it looks like the uh, the glitch failed. You guys saw that Bobot was trying to... Um, Bug postal out. I might just be a spectator for this fight, to be honest. Might be on the sidelines the whole time. You guys aren't luring it away. I wish you guys would lure it uh, away from the center, but I, I guess only Bobot knows about that strat. The wake for it probably doesn't. But yeah. As long as he has a spore cap up, my spiders are going to get annihilated. And if if these guys are caught in his uh, summoning screeching thing, then there's nothing I can do. They're probably going to get annihilated too. Yeah. <laughs> I'll cheer you guys on. Good job, guys. Keep it up. We're just throwing. Yeah, because she's uh, not luring it, right? You gotta lure it to the outside. Spiders here just because um, there's gonna be a worm wave. I'll give Wake for it a golden axe. Yeah, guys, I can't really help all that much. Get back, get back. And I think he's too close to the center. He's gonna, he's not gonna, like he's gonna instantly spawn them, right? Yeah, he's way too close. Or he's gonna walk back. So oh, he's gonna walk back. I wonder how much damage that does. Probably a thousand, yeah. I'm gonna save these spiders until the worm wave. Oh, that's what you meant by throwing. Messing up the... Oh, he's doing it. But you know what, Wigfoot is helping to chop the trees, so it might all, all like balance out.
Wait, Wicker can't even eat that. What the hell? <laughs> no, get out of the sport cloud. Get out, get out. Okay, here we go. Let's see if this works. Four trees. No, didn't work. <laughs> I think it's because he wasn't walking back to the center. And I can't really help out because if I get too close... Actually, maybe I can. I can cut down some of these trees. Abandon. Abandon ship. Actually, I do... I do have more monster meat for you. I do have three monster meat. So you could, uh... I have one more transformation. It's okay if we abandon ship, man. We don't have to fight. We don't have to be told to. I'm like, I'm almost useless in this fight. Actually, this might be helpful if I just stay away. Okay, you quit. Okay. Alright. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, I gotta find a cave entrance to to get out of here. Tentacle is probably back up, right? Yep. Which means I can do this. It's a great way to farm spots and stuff. Equal spots and uh, spikes. Actually, I should probably get a spike. Combat spoiled. Is there a spike on this end? Spot. Spike. There we go. I just gotta get out of this cave entrance. But spiders. Alright, Bobot. I got 10 grass. How much backpacks is that? 16. That's four backpacks. Four, that's eight. Ugh. Including the one I have, that's 8 times 4 is 32, that's not nearly enough, damn it. Oh. Right, I'm going to start starving to death too. Then there's these stupid bunny men. 
Things are not going that well. I guess I'll just use this entrance. Because I haven't found anything else. What? <laughs> what? I didn't want a fucking top hat. And apparently I can only make three. Men. Gotta kill all these guys. Want any interference? Okay. What else can I drop? Let's drop everything. I have a lot of useless stuff. And if only Clay had designed Weber better, so he didn't have to do this crap. Just uh, teleport the spiders with you, man. How hard is that? Okay, is that all the backpacks? You know what? It's possible that nobody is going to be by spawn. It is possible. I swear guys, it gets better. It gets better once I get to the surface, man. <laughs> okay, I haven't played words, but do you guys know if Merms, like, they switch shards with you? nobody go to the to spawn. I should have typed that in chat. Uh, no, I mean, if if they don't switch shards with you as Wirt, then I'm afraid that, like, as Weber, they're not going to change it so that the spider switch shards too. At best, they might come up with a thing where you can put your spiders in, like, a special item. 
that has like a thousand inventory slots. But that doesn't seem like the best solution. Man, I really hope nobody goes to spawn. Switch shards. Shards means like, uh, you know, there's like the surface world and the cave world. That's what people mean by shard. I was hoping that when Weber gets his skill tree, Clay changes it so that if you switch to the surface world or the cave world, all your spiders follow you. But it doesn't look like that's going to happen. If they didn't change it for Wurt, probably not going to change it for Weber. I mean, I'm glad that there are solutions like this, but it's just so tedious. And there's so much room for like things to go really wrong. Oh my gosh, this Woody. Man, if, if I had come here a second later, this Woody would have been dead. You know what, this guy, let's see, let's inspect this dude. This guy's gonna die. 100% he's gonna come back. They are hostile when you go back. Uh, they're like, they get, if somebody else is in, the, is in the vicinity of them, when they are not, when you're in a different shard, then that breaks your connection to them and they become just regular spiders. I might have to befriend all these guys again. All because of this Woody. We'll see. I was pretty vague with my instructions to them. So it could be my fault. But... Yeah. I'm almost certain that, that, that Woody's gonna die. Spike, the Magi, uh, uh, what else can I? Okay, moment of truth, guys. Is Woody getting destroyed by spiders? We shall see. I have a feeling he is. Prove me wrong, Woody. Prove me wrong. But Mikey said I almost walked into that, so that... Would he ran for his life? I don't know, man. If Mikey said I almost walked into that, then that leads me to believe... Whoa! They're still friended. Uh, some of them are not friended, though. That's pretty good. Actually, not that bad. Okay, let's see if these guys are friended. Uh, yep, they still are. That is great. This is a couple I lost. Yeah, I don't have as much, I think. Okay, though. I got some pig skin. Befriend you. Yeah, this this army is considerably smaller. Okay, though. Hopefully, Woody learned his lesson.
Who's that? Mikey is Woody. Hey, Mikey. I guess we do have a spawn base. Oh, that monster meat. Get the monster meat. Oh, wait, twins? No, we're not doing twins, man. Get the terraria. That's it for house, right? Yeah. Minor hat spider. <laughs> Oh, more monster meat. What's up with all the monster meat? Oh, tentacles. I hear it. Get him, boys. Okay, we gotta find a week for it. Oh, there. Okay. What? What was that pause?
Okay, they said Dragonfly is close to, to uh, picking. I don't see it. He's at it right there. Yeah, it looks like it. Wait, Mikey, if you're going to turn into the moose, uh, please don't charge my spiders. You just kill them all. Alright, here we go. Oh, these pigs are going to interfere. Come on. <laughs> okay, wall this dragonfly. What? Oh, okay. Don't kill all the lobby, Mikey. Don't kill him. Don't kill the last one. Whatever you do. Alright, there's food lobby over there. One more. Alright, he's going back to spawn. Make sure I'm the- I, I want to be the closest one when it spawns lava. Oh. I think it's dead already. Probably really low. Oh! That face. Never mind. I still got most of my spiders. You know what? 5000 HP, we could probably drain it before it enrages. Oh, 
the spider died. Okay, kill the pigs. I think my spider army took a hit. And my backpack is gone. No. Okay, let's kill Beakwee now. And then let's just leave. That's all there is to the server. I don't know where Beakwee is, by the way. Let's see. Is... Is that it there? Mikey, do you have the map mod? You know where Bee Queen is, Mikey? Oh yeah, I also don't have a hammer. And I don't have the materials to craft one. Oh yeah, can I have a walking stick, Mikey? <laughs> some tentacles while we're here. No, I'm insane. Oh, so is this Bee Queen right there? What? Somebody was trying to do the, the thing. The oven. Like it didn't work out. Is that Bullbot? It's probably Bullbot. Okay, yeah, they, I don't know what happened here. Did they just not... They ran on materials or something? Let's see. Here, here's, let's play uh, Sherlock Holmes. By picking up this pedal, we can kind of tell how long it's been since the person was here. Okay, it's halfway spoiled, so that's like a couple days. Couldn't be in Boba then.
give Mikey my monster meat. Oh my gosh, that wall is horrible. It's like really messing everything up. Now we can fight it. Alright, phase one down. Just gonna scream. Wait for the scream. Ah, uh, the stupid bee. Get away from me. Get out of the scream. Ah. That beat wasn't chasing me, I could have blown the weather with him. No, no, don't go to me. Come on, guys. Alright, there we go. We dodged it. Get out of there. I'm gonna scream. Oh my gosh. Stop running towards me, Big Green. Awesome. What? I don't know, I think that the spiders were more helpful than they were not. Oh, Mike is charging. Watch out.
I don't know if you can do it within uh, two days, day 19 already. I'm gonna do I'm gonna clear out the swamp. That's what I'm gonna do. We're just gonna leave all the D Queen loot here. Is that the plan? <laughs> Wait, is this swamp? Swamp was like right here? Mikey, give me this. No, no, Mikey, leave it on the ground. Unless you need to eat, like, unless you're starving to death. <laughs> You're placing it like... Oh wait, somebody took the crown and the blueprint. Are you starving to death? Is that why you went back for the royal jelly? Okay. Uh, I have some honey if you want that. I guess you're okay with the butterflies. What is going on over here? 
Wait, Mikey. <laughs> Mikey, should I just leave? Should I surround this war talks and just leave? Or should I surround like no? <laughs> if you're bored, I don't know what else to do. I'm gonna clear out the swamp. Um, these guys can't fight the twins unless I'm like really coordinated. Fuel Weaver is a no-go. Uh, yeah, all I can do is just steamroll things like Tawbirds and stuff. Can someone res this dude? Uh, I, I can't. I don't have the materials. Oh, he should have picked Walter for the pieces. Actually, yeah, the Shadow Pieces fight would have been pretty interesting. But, uh... Actually, I... <laughs> Mikey, should I... <laughs> should I work on the, uh... The shoe box? Yeah, I think that's what I should do. I should make a shoe box and then surround one guy. And just shoe all my spiders on them. Or the boat! No, we should convince people to go boating. Nah, I should just shoe box everything. Okay, okay. Alright, that's that's how we're gonna leave the server. I'm gonna shoebox uh, my spiders onto one poor guy. Should do that to the guy who saw five hundred spiders. <laughs> no Mikey, I wanna Mikey, can you convince people to go to Lunar Island? Devin, I think Devin is watching the stream. He's way too eager to go to Lunar Island. I mean, in three days I can fight Klaus. What do I need for the shoe box? I need. Oh. I don't even need anything in the swamp. Okay, Mikey, you want to work on the boat? You give me a gland. Uh, I don't have a gland. How am I supposed to fight these dudes with this army? Oh, Mikey, can you make me two boards since you're woody? I need two boards and I can make the, the shoe box. Crap, it's day 20, you're gonna freeze to death too. Alright, let's go. Um, Mikey, I need one board, or two boards. If you can get, uh, if you have board crafting. Which you probably do, because you have walking stick. 
Here, I got some wood. Hungry, uh, here. That's all I got. Actually, you know what? You do this. You really hungry? Just gotta pick up the meat real quick. Grab the meat, grab the meat! Most of it. I got like three meats out of that. I don't know about you. You can have all the meat. Oh, here's dogs. That's more meat for me. Yeah, I just need the two boards and I can make a few bucks. I'm insane though. Gosh, how am I supposed to fight these guys? It's army. Actually, Mikey, 
screw, screw the boat. I think I should just do it right here. There's two people. Uh, it's right here. Or should I go to the other base? Maybe I should go to the other base and just flood it with spiders. Opposer griefed? Yeah, let's go to the other base. Opposer's a griefer. Colonel Autumn. Colonel Autumn. Okay, that's our target, guys. Alright, Mikey. Let's go. Let's do this. Grief to griefer. Just kick a poser. <laughs> this guy. Sure you do. Okay, let's check this out. Oh wow, really? You got, uh, <laughs> this guy has wear beaver mastery and he's telling us to kick somebody else. Interesting. <laughs> Where Beaver Mastery, and he's not the griefer. Sure. We don't have a magic, do we? That would've been the best. If you could put this guy to sleep with a magic, but I haven't found a... I guess that's the magic forest? Or maybe not. Actually, no, let's probably move stone. Whatever's. All right, where is he? He's, he's at the uh, picking base, yeah? No, 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 Mikey, I don't think we even need it. So 
he's at picking base, yeah? There he is. Alright. You guys ready? Wait, he's not here. Oh, wait, he's right here. Get wrecked. Get wrecked, you griefer. <laughs> yeah, he's not the griefer. We all know you are. There's no Woody who would have wear beaver mastery. <laughs> and I caught it on camera. It's a poser griefing. No, a poser's a poser's been in this thing since like the very beginning. <laughs> Okay guys, I think that's it. I did the runes rush. I'm gonna starve to death. I think I'll end the stream here. Justice has been served. We got the griefer. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that's why you don't mess with Weber. stream for too long and I my computer shut down my other computer that I used to read chat I haven't been seeing what people are saying I'm sorry guys uh, let's read the chat before I leave um, Woody ran for his life one zero spiders to Woody poor B Queen will stand zero chance yeah you can't even do twins 20 day cooldown uh, I saw the, I thought that the terrarium was activated. Minor hat spider coming in clutch. <laughs> I'll be heading out. Have fun with the rest, Lardy. I guess I'll have to wait for more wake for his body skin name. Sick implies that you are feeling unwell physically. Beaver mastery. Yup. 100% that guy was a griefer, man. There's no doubt about it. We got griefed by this troll and his friend about a week ago. Yeah, it's always the two guys. Actually, I, I actually caught them on video. Like, I was recording a public server game. And I, he was going by a different name, but it was him and his friend. So he goes Beaver, except he picks the mastery at the very end, so nobody knows. But you can, I mean, you obviously can know. But uh, yeah, he, he destroyed our base, but right before that, his friend was like picking up all the good stuff, like all the good items. I think his friend was like a War Tox. I think it's the same two guys all the time. Yeah, anyway, guys, had a good, fun little Weber runes rush. Unfortunately, we couldn't do Toadstool, Bulbot had to ditch, um, or had to ditch, had to leave, but yes, I think it was a pretty cool stream. I might make a highlight reel on my Lardy Clips channel, who knows? Uh, depends on how things look. But yeah, thanks for sticking around, I'm not sure whoever is here. Mikey, thanks for all the help as usual. 
Um, dude, I really want to do that that monkey pirate raid thing. So we gotta figure out a time. But yeah, there are a group of at least four or five people, and they also use alternate accounts. I think I have most of their Steam profiles, like, like copied. I think one of their Steam names, or like the the Steam URL, has like Tree Jam in it, if I'm not mistaken. All this over DST is hella extra. <laughs> yeah, we're at like the end game. We're like at the final stages of DST enjoyment. It's like you beat, you make a base, that's how you start. And then you start rushing bosses and stuff. And then once you're reaching like the end of your DST enjoyment, you start just pranking other people. As long as we don't turn into like full on griefers, you know, that just wear beaver the base. Then I think we're good. I think these little pranks that we do are okay. Tree Jam Nobby Seed, yep. That's one of them. The real end game is participating in Don Gianni's tournament. Uh, he hasn't asked me since like September. I think he has a whole lineup of other people in front of me. Actually, the real end game of DST is jumping on Left 4 Dead 2 <laughs> and playing versus mode. <laughs> That's when you know you had enough of this game. Our duel is going to be a thing. Dude. Like other than Wigfrid and uh, and Wartox, what other characters really supplement each other? You can say like Maxwell and, and Wickerbottom, but Maxwell is just like the same as Wickerbottom once he gets the books. There's no like two-way synergy going on there really. Slingshot. We just wing it. Go our mains. Uh, I'm not going to pick Wendy, that's for sure, because what's his face? Quakes is going to use Wendy in this next one. So I don't want it to be redundant. Um, I have a bunch of other characters. Like, I'll go w wait for it or hopefully Weber. I, I really hope I can do something with Weber because nobody else is going to pick him. And then uh, Winona is like a backup of the backup. Weber, man. Weber can carry you through, B-Queen. Fear Power. You're the Weber guy. I remember that name. It was you and this other dude who were uh, really a fan of like the Weber stuff that we did. But yeah, guys. I think I'm going to hop off. I've been streaming for, what is it, three hours three plus hours so i'm gonna get something to eat we'll be back on later just to do some non-streaming fun stuff maybe left for that too i don't know we'll see i'm just happy man i'm happy we got to kill the griefer like it's much better i, I was gonna do like the boat thing but then so much more satisfying to do it against people who deserve it yeah all right, guys, I'll catch you all later. Wait, I, I should raid somebody. Who should I raid? Uh, who is playing this game right now? Raid Madness of Math. Don Gianni? Okay. Is he playing right now? Raid. Don. What is his name? His actual name. Don Gianni Guides. All right. Let's do this.